a theory today. I was driving around New York City and I uh, came about the power plant. And then I just wondered to myself, what in the world is this doing here? How sanitary is this? 24-7, 365 days a year. There is this brown sort of what, whatever this is pouring into the Liberty County room. And it's been doing this for four years now. Yeah, four years, roughly four years now. Uh, non-stop every single day, even when the river was green. So what is this? What is this strange thing that is being pumped into the river? Well, first of all, let's get right into this. You can see the pumps come directly from the power plant, or we can assume so. Unless they do go along the riverbed somewhere, I'm not sure where they go, but it is safe to make a, an assumption that it comes directly from the power plant. As you can see, it lines up nearly perfectly with the steam towers as well. So, uh, yeah, we can assume it comes from the power plant, as also it kind of goes underground a bit more, heading towards the power plant. Um, so anyways, it comes from the power plant. I did a bit of research before this video. However, I do not know every single thing about how power plants work, and there's many different types of power plants in the world and uh, everything like this. But um, most power plants these days, they use water to generate electricity, and also they use water to cool down the steam, uh, the steam tacks or steam, steam stack towers. That sounds so wrong saying that, but yeah, they use uh, water to cool it down. However, this is putting stuff into the water, as you can see, not pulling stuff out of the water. Um, and at no place does it uh, appear that there's any sort of vent linking, linking to the water. So we can assume that this power plant is quite old and they haven't really thought about uh, connecting it to the water. As you can see, there is a, um, a sort of tunnel here. However, we can safely assume that leads directly to here, mainly because they are uh, exactly in line and also because you know it kind of does make sense uh, leading the lake into the river anyways so we can assume that there is nothing going in to cool basically the power plant down but there's things coming out so what could this be now someone had a I saw this on the PRC discord someone had the very good thought of these actually aren't from the power plant however they're from one of the distribution centers and the waste centers around there so the garbage drop-off is over there and if they come out from here, they may go underneath the power plant over to the garbage drop-off or some sort of waste facility which manages um, the waste from Liberty County. And someone was saying this most likely is the waste from uh, all of those buildings, all of those toilets and whatnot. Um, and you are probably right. Now, they don't simply dump uh, brown liquids into the water 24-7. Of course, most places it would be cleaned and it would go through processing and then that water would go back into there's many many different ways of doing this honestly it really depends where you are but um i think there are two options for what this could be firstly this could be excess waste from the power plant secondly this could be from some sort of chemical plant which processes all the waste from the liberty county sewage systems and then pumps it out into the river but why is it brown why is there this really murky brown liquid? And if so, why are they still pumping out after four years? Well, here is here is what I think. Here is what I think. Um, I think there is some sort of chemical inside of this that makes it brown. Because there is absolutely no way that the Liberty County government, who, uh, yep, they operate out of that floor over there. There is no way that they allow, they would be allowing this for four years straight going into the river, contaminating the river. However, if this is the case, I think we've got our, our next project on hand to uh, take down this uh, plant that is pumping this into the river. However, I can safely assume from a bit of research, well, five minutes Googling, um, as well as talking to other people, this is most likely waste from the power plant um, that is somewhat clean or some sort of chemical coming out of a waste management facility that deals with the sewers and it's just got some liquid or some sort of uh, chemical in it that makes it turn brown, hopefully. So anyways, um, yeah, strange video here today, but you know, make sure to subscribe for more videos like this because very informative on the channel. And if I am wrong, please comment below because uh, I get to learn something new. All right, thank you very much for watching. And let's hope this is actually clean liquids that's being pumped into our river.